Turn to girls basketball, where the Linton HMB Lions are one of the contenders for a state title in Class B. But with a new head coach, it was change in the game plan that has vaulted them to the top. Phil Bonatti has more. When Bo Deagle took over the team this year, he knew he had a lot of great players to work with. But one big change for the Lady Lions is their switch to a man-to-man -man defense. You know, just the new stuff that they learned. We had a lot of put in this year, and they've been really adaptive to the new stuff they're doing. And, you know, sometimes even me as a coach taking some old stuff that they like to do and utilize that. These players haven't played much man-to-man -man in their high school career, but the results speak for themselves as they have a 12-3 record overall. Instead of having your own spot, there's no girl there. You're always in help, like, and sometimes, and all over. But this, like, you have a girl in your honor, and it's aggressive, and that's how I like playing basketball. Deagle says this team is aggressive on the defensive side, a challenge they have met. Another challenge for the Lady Lions is getting past District 6 rival Kidder County. It just shows how much you have to work to really achieve, how great of a goal it is to make it to state. I mean, it's just, just that much harder, and when if you do make it, I feel like it just be that much more satisfying. But beyond the game plan, these players bring great energy each and every practice. They uh, love each other, and that's probably the best characteristic you can have as a team. You know, they're best friends with one another. So practice, you know, it's, it's competitive. They like to compete, and they like to get after it. So I'm proud to coach a team like that. Reporting for KX Sports in Linton, I'm Phil Bonatti. The Lions are in action tonight. They are on the road taking on Medina, Pingree, Buchanan.